Hello dudes, welcome to techtool.com. In this video, we are going to learn about post and pre increment operators. So let's begin. Let's say you have a variable count. The post or pre increment operator helps, helps you to increment the value of your variable by one at a time. Okay, so if the symbol of post increment operator and pre increment operator both are plus plus but if you put it after your variable this will act as post increment operator but if you put it before your variable it will act as pre increment operator okay both will increase the value of your variable by one but there is some difference between them. We will come come to it later. First, say if you this will increment your value of your variable count by one, and you assign it to some other variable p. Similarly, here if you assign it to some other variable p, what will happen? For post increment operator, first the value of count will be assigned to your variable p. So I have forgotten to write the semicolon sign. So here also there will be semicolon. Okay. So the value of count will be assigned to p and then its value will be incremented by 1. So what is happening if the count initially contains and then you write count plus plus after execution of this statement you will have for this statement you will have p equal to 5 and after this statement is executed you will have count equal to 6 okay so in post increment operator remember that first the value of the variable will be assigned to uh, wherever it is belongs to in p and then its value the original value will be incremented okay so for pre increment operator you can guess first the value of the variable is incremented by one and then the modified value will be assigned to the variable p so here if count was initially five after execution of this statement we will have count equal to 6 and also p equal to 6 because only after the incremented increment increment part you will the value will be assigned to the other variable okay so if your statement is only count plus plus or only plus plus count it does not matter whichever you write it will increment the value of count by 1 but if you are assigning it to some other variable just try to focus on which case you want. You want to put the initialize the value before the increment happens or after it. So according to your choice you can use post or pre increment operator. Similarly we have post and pre decrement operator. The sign is minus minus. Same thing happens here. So it will act exactly like post and pre increment operator but here the value will be decremented in case of increment. Okay. So this is all about post and pre increment and decrement operator. See you in the next video. Thank you for watching.